Okay, it's been been with Ritter chilies. I thought I just I needed to get to these into the ground, so I thought I'd just go ahead and review the last one I have. Um, except for the T-Rex uh, T-Rex chocolate. But I don't even know if it has any pods yet. I'm not even sure if I'm gonna have any of those this year. You know, a lot of these, this one got planted late as well. This is the Jay's Peach Ghost, Peach Ghost Scorpion, the classic. Not quite ripe on the tip. You kind of see that the rest is kind of more cream colored. I think anyway. Anyway, yeah, Jay's Peach Ghost Scorpion. Really pretty pod. Really pretty. I like, I like it. Um, yeah, but I need to get some seeds into the ground in my, uh, one of my little growing areas. So, and I had, I went ahead and planted, um, yeah, this came out pretty easily, so hopefully that's a good sign. Um, I went ahead and planted, uh, what did I plant? Um, T-Rex mustard and, I can't even remember, wow, it's crazy. Anyway, I planted some pods and I needed to plant the rest. I kind of feel like I'd like them to be on the same day. So anyway, here I am. Didn't quite kind of slice into it too well, but there's the inside. Chinins maybe? Maybe a little fruity. Not a ton of seeds though, geez Louise. Fresh, fresh, good taste, good flavor. I, I don't know how I describe the flavor necessarily, but good flavor. I like fresh, really like tasting. Chininzi, kind of sweet fruity maybe? I don't know. Starting to sweat a little bit. I had some pods earlier. Wow. So, I was on the fence about this pod. I can't remember why, but I was. And the dude who grew this J, pretty good. Yeah, I'll say it. like you can tell he knows what he's doing. <clears throat> it's really, really pretty. <clears throat> Not a big seed producer though. <clears throat> All I was like, like trying to put I need to get. It's only three minutes in. Hopefully, I can be done by the time. A lot easier getting out that T-Rex mustard seeds. <clears throat> Hopefully that's ripe enough. A little oily. I'm gonna placenta. I should get these seeds off. I think that's everything. Just the placenta. <clears throat> placenta now. <clears throat> it just tastes fresh, tastes good. Not as hot as I was expecting, honestly. The T-Rex mustard that I had earlier today was hotter. <clears throat> I had the skunk, I had the skunk too. That might have been hotter too. Crick, crick, um, <clears throat> kind of a crisp burn. Kind of crick, crickly. I don't know if that's a word, but I like the sound of fire makes. Crackly. Bright. Kind of sharp. Very tip of the tongue. Front and middle. Mostly 90, 89%. Back of the tongue. Up to the 
up of the mouth a little bit too. <clears throat> not a throat burner though, not really. I was expecting a really bad throat puncture, but nothing compared to Chocolate Scorpion. I don't, really, I don't really feel it in my throat, really. It's even creasing on the front of the tongue a little bit. That's kind of cool. It's building, you know, it really is a builder. Like, I wasn't too impressed with it, but now <clears throat> that's pretty, pretty decent heat, especially for a peach. Probably 1.34, 5 maybe. Oh. <clears throat> I'm gonna say 1.6, 1.7 actually, that's pretty hot. <clears throat> Maybe not, I don't know. It, it, it's hot though. I'm gonna guess it cleared 1.5 though. I am gonna say that. Migrating to the front of the throat a little bit. <clears throat> I've also got like all of my fingers. Oh, harvesting seeds, so. <clears throat> it's kind of all over my body right now. In my eyes, starting to get in my eyes too. <clears throat> uh, I hate when I do that, but like, oh, it's in my nose. But uh, I just hate wearing gloves. Like, it's hard for me to manipulate stuff. <clears throat> I know it's pretty dumb, but I don't know. I'm lazy, I guess. Or lazy, damn smart. <clears throat> it's definitely a crescendo. Down slope. <clears throat> Probably front of the throat a little bit. Mostly in the mouth and the tongue though. That actually, yeah, front of the throat a little bit now and then maybe the middle point of the throat a little bit. <clears throat> flavor, not super pronounced flavor, but so fresh tasting. I'm gonna give it one thumb up. Heat, two thumbs, especially for a peach. Very hot, but I'd say, I'd say one point, over 1.5. <clears throat> Not a throat burner, so I'm happy about that. Mostly tongue and mouth. Some throat though. Um, great look. Two thumbs up for a look maybe, I think. Maybe one and a half. Good, good looking pod. Prolific plant, two thumbs up for the plant. Pretty good endorphins too. Gotta give a thumb or two up for that too. I guess it's about everything. <clears throat> yeah, so Ben with Rinder Chilies. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, definitely a classic, an oldie, but a goodie. But yeah, think about that one. That's pretty decent. So cheers, bye.